I am worried. And I ought not to worry. But because I can't stop worrying, I'm worried because I worry. Once they make themselves worry about anything, then they realize, they observe, they see that they are really off the goddamn wall and worried. And that's very uncomfortable and also leads to greater failure, including the failure of people observing that you worry. So they worry about worry. And you see where that could lead to. Once you start thinking about things, you worry as to whether you've thought enough. To fail, to be rejected, to look foolish, to make a fool of myself, to even appear anxious, not only to be anxious, but it adds another vector, that if I appear anxious to other humans, that's terrible to speak poorly, etc., etc. There are a million of them. Did you really take all the details into consideration? Was every fact properly reviewed? And by Jove, the more you think about it, the more you realize that uh, you really couldn't take everything into consideration because all the variables in any human decision are incalculable. And that is what we call anxiety, trembling. And, and this is uh, the human problem. And this, though, also, this is the price you pay for knowing that you know, for being able to think about thinking, to feel about feeling. We're always entering a new environment. We don't ever know fully what the new environment is, because the only environments we know are the past ones. But this discipline that we're talking about of Nagarjuna's abolishes anxiety because you discover that no amount of anxiety makes any difference to anything that's going to happen. To just accept the fact that you're going to often have mediocre solutions to them and then you just accept that and that will help you live with them. In other words, from the first standpoint, the worst is going to happen. You're all going to die. And don't just put it off in the back of your mind and say, I'll consider that later. <laughs> it's the most important thing to consider now because it enables you, it is the mercy of nature because it's going to enable you to let go and not defend yourself all the time waste all the energies in self-defense.